Hey, what's up, everybody? This is uh, Inquisitor Eisen on Overlip again. And this video is going to be kind of different. This is my first ever video. Well, the first ever video I'm shooting outside. I'm at my uh, secret mail location where I live. People steal my mail. I live in an apartment building. That's nothing, though, about my living whereabouts. <clears throat> but, uh, yeah, this is where I receive my mail. All of my, you know, great. PS2 games and PS2 consoles that I have, and I figured I'd do an a, a, a uh, unboxing video of a PS2, an original PS2 that I just ordered. Maybe I, I ordered two of them, and I did some research online and found out that uh, the S S the model SCPH39001 of the big model PS2, which is the ones that I like, that's the best model number. <clears throat> and I have, I had, I have three backup PS2s, but I just recently learned, I just recently learned that uh, two of them don't work. I mean, I tested them when I got them, but, you know, like, I guess my, you know, my taste in PS2s or, you know, like, the stuff I look for in consoles have changed throughout the years. And I go back to look at the consoles that I have on backup. <clears throat> One barely works. Another one works, but it doesn't play blue disc. I've cleaned them both out. I've, I've, I've cleaned the limbs of both of them. And, you know, they both, you know, work whenever they want. And the other model I have, my third one, is a <clears throat> 3 SEPH30001. That works flawlessly. That's probably the, probably the cleanest one that I have. But it's not really the model number I want. I'm going to keep it anyways. So I did. So I, I I went online on eBay. I didn't really have a lot of luck. Or I don't believe in luck. I didn't have a lot of success finding the model numbers on Amazon. Even though Amazon has you know the most as far as like variety <coughs> for original PS2s, it's just they rarely ever the sellers rarely ever they rarely ever post the model number. So yeah, I just ordered two PS2s on eBay, <coughs> the model numbers that I wanted. One of them I don't know how I missed this, but one of them actually has a crack it has a crack in the AV port I'll, I'll show you what I'm talking about but uh in one of them I actually ordered the wrong model number I don't know how that happened I guess I was just too excited or whatever anyway I've rambled on long enough let's do the unboxing I never did this on camera before I, mean, I, I never did an unboxing video before but I, figured, I figured I would and just to give you guys an example of like what kind of buyer I am and like the kind of like quality that I demand <clears throat> when shopping online. I'm trying my best to hide my name. I don't want my name to be shown. Hang on one second. This is gonna take a second. too much because if, if, if the system is what I expected it to be in the condition or well not what I expected but if the system doesn't meet the pictures that I saw on eBay then I have a problem This is the console, obviously. And I'm guessing this. Oh, oh, how uh, how sweet. I guess this is like if I don't like the condition or whatever, I can mail it back. That was nice of him to do that. Ah, hopefully this thing is in good condition, and I won't have to uh, actually uh, buy it back. But I was really looking for a... Let me 
do some the sunlight sun. Uh, hang on a second. Hang on a second. There we go. This is. Oh, this is the 5000. Yeah, that's the one I have at home. 500. 5001. <clears throat> that's the other backup at home I have. But like I said, I'm looking for the 39001. I don't know if you guys can see that or not. One thing I was looking for, I don't know how I missed this either. I was looking for something that didn't have the strip. Because if it didn't have the strip, that would tell me that they at least went through the trouble of cleaning it. Cleaning it, you know, uh, properly or, or at least that the system has been opened. I was trying to avoid this right here because I know that, like, if it has a strip on it, it's probably never been opened. And if it's never been opened, then it's probably going to have a lot of dirt and dust <coughs> inside of it. Or it might not. <coughs> you know, the seller said uh, that they cleaned it or whatever. And, and I'm, I'm sure they did clean it, but I'm, I'm almost positive they didn't clean the inside because the seal is still intact. <coughs> so I don't know how I actually missed that right there. So let's go ahead and crack this bad boy open. Don't use the plastic, let's just examine it. I must say it's a pretty handsome console. It matches the description that I saw on on eBay, or you know, uh, the pictures. It's very very clean. My only problem is I'm, c I'm currently looking on Amazon or I'm looking on YouTube right now to see if there's a way to replace this. And I know how to take apart PS2s and stuff, <clears throat> you know, f from almost top to bottom. It's just uh, I'm not really sure. I'd, 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 have to, I'd have to take it apart again. I would have to take apart my system again just to see if I know how to replace this. Because I have two PS2s at home, two backups that aren't really working out for me. And I, I don't think I'm going to be using I, I don't think I'll be using them in the future. So I'm, I'm hoping there's a way I can actually take this apart, disconnect this right here, and just take one from my other, my other PS2 and just pop it in here. You know, one of the ones that I don't want. Or not don't want, but one of the ones that are, that are scraps. <clears throat> I'm really hoping I can do that, because if I can do that, and with this condition, like, it, it looks very good. I have yet to open it up, <clears throat> which I'll do when I get home. And, uh, very clean. Extremely clean. I haven't turned it on yet or anything like that. But hopefully, everything works. And hopefully I can replace that that thing and like I said I don't know how I overlooked this I was looking at the thing I, I, was, I spent like a week on eBay almost looking for the perfect or you know the most affordable and cleanest fat model PS2s I could find and I don't know how in the world I overlooked this right I don't know like I said I'm, I must have just been too excited or something like that <clears throat> but let's take a look at the inside just to see maybe this will give me an idea of how dirty the inside is probably not Let's see if I can get the expansion bay open. That's how the inside looks. And yeah, I, I might make another video. <clears throat> I think I might make another video, another unboxing video of uh, the next PS2 that I receive as well. Because I have two of them coming in the mail. One of them I know for sure. I know for sure it's, a, uh, it's the model that I want. Hopefully it's in the condition and in the working order that I want. I've seen pictures, but I got to take it apart and see for myself. But yeah, you know, I, I just figured that I, that I would do a video. You know, because I'm not doing videos. You know, Let's Plays right now, at least until September. This is July. So I figured I'd just do a video just to let you guys know what I've been up to. <clears throat> and, you know, you, you know I love Sixth Generation. So yeah, my, my pickups for this month would have been two of these or you know they are for this month I bought two of these and I bought Evolution Worlds for the uh, GameCube and also Fantasy Star Card Revolution for the GameCube and I'll see you guys later